Lieutenant Colonel Ferdinand Marcelino is asking the Manila Regional Trial Court to dismiss drug charges against him. But state prosecutors say there's overwhelming evidence against Marcelino after he was arrested during a drug raid on January 21. 76 kilograms yung nakuhang droga sa loob ng bahay sa Celadon Place. Marcelino says he was just working undercover when police caught him. But the prosecutor says Marcelino has no proof he was on an official mission. Binigyan siya ng pagkakataon na magpresinta ng authority niya doon. Okay. Hindi siya nakapagpresinta. Last week, the Justice Department filed charges against Marcelino for the possession of illegal drugs. Marcelino's lawyer, Persida Acosta, says there is no probable cause to arrest him. He was just framed up. Inamin po ng mga testigo na wala pong nakuwang droga sa kanya. Acosta adds Marcelino's arrest was illegal as he was just performing his job when he was arrested. Acosta says Marcelino is also a commendable soldier and he was known for running after drug lords. Because if ever ihaharas siya ng bonggang bongga, ay eh, wala na pong sundalo na mag, magkakaroon lakas ng loob na pagamit sa pamahalaan upang maproteksyonan ang national security and interest. Prosecutors also question Acosta and Marcelino's visits to Justice Secretary Vitaliano Aguirre and House Speaker Pantaleon Alvarez. If they're going to the Secretary of Justice, what does that mean? CNN Philippines chants upon Acosta outside the office of Alvarez but declined to give us an interview. Both Marcelino's camp and the state prosecution will file their comments in the coming days. Rex Remitio, CNN Philippines.